Hey, the city council is ready to put its final stamp of approval on a crackdown aimed at short term rentals. Yeah, their vote, though, might not be the end of the fight over these regulations. 10 News reporter Mimi Alcala joins us live with the potential options ahead. Mimi. Yeah, Jim, Virginia, the new regulations on vacation rentals, just like this one here in Crown Point, already passed on July 16th. But today, the city council will possibly adopt them into law at a meeting this afternoon. The best that we can hope for is that the city council will uh, prevail in uh, going ahead with the modified ordinance that they came up with at the last meeting. David Austin, a board member with Save San Diego Neighborhood, says he's been fighting to keep the homes in his specific neighborhood strictly for neighbors, not vacation rentals. In a 6-3 to three vote two weeks ago, the city council did decide to regulate the short-term vacation rentals. Hosts will only be allowed to rent out their primary residence and an additional unit if it's on the same property like a duplex. But vacation rentals in second homes will be outlawed. The new regulations are expected to go into effect of July of next year, but many supporters of these rentals are not giving up their fight. They say this puts many hardworking San Diegans out of business and will result in the loss of millions of dollars for the city. They even plan on possibly taking this to court. The city council meeting begins at 1 o'clock today and public comment is expected. We're live in Crown Point, Mimi Alcala, 10 News.